This is 10 coding tips that you should know if you want to be a pro developer. Let's start right now. This is a very simple code, but it's also super bad because there is a double negation. The variable not admin with the negation before make it way complex to read for nothing. This is a very bad thing to do and it's so confusing. You should create only positive variables. Some people will say that you need to add a comment to explain the condition. But this brings us to the second tip. Never use comments. Well, as much as possible. Why? First, your code should speak for himself. Second, less comments you have, less maintenance you need. Third, the code with comments is just longer to read and we don't want that. What we want is cleaner code, so try to avoid writing comments. But there is many other beginner mistakes in this code, and I will show you all the tips that you need to become a better developer. Without these tips, you will stay a beginner and you don't want that. Another mistake is to declare badly your variables. I have a step-by-step -step formula for this. When you create a boolean, make sure it starts with is. In this way, it's clear for the reader that it's a boolean. Otherwise, it could be a string or any other type. People should understand the type without looking at the the variable. Also, make sure that it is positive. When you need any other variables, create a well-defined name for it. Don't make variables that we can't understand like this. Also, never have magic number in your code. What is 5.5? No one's know, and it can be anything. So create a constant variable with a clear name like this. But this is still wrong. Why? Because you should always define the type of your variables. Even though it's better, there is still a big problem here. You should never create functions with more than three arguments. Creating a function with less arguments make it easier to read. And if you absolutely need to pass more variables, this means you should create a class with the information inside. Also, if you pass too many arguments, this probably means that you don't respect the single responsibility code rule. This rule said that every function does one thing only, but it does it really, really well. In this code, we want to have the full name of the user, but we also remove the letters over 40 characters. This is super bad, because someone using your function, we'll never know that the words will be cut if it's over 40 characters. In this case, you must create two functions. One will only concatenate the word, and the other one will remove letters over 40 characters. But what about the concatenation? Beginners will concatenate string, but pros will instead interpolate the value. You can do this with the curly bracket, because it is more readable and better overall. This will return the exact same thing in the console. But wait, this just create a brand new problem. Zombie code. If you want to be a pro, always remove the old code. Never keep code in your comments. Why? First, as you know, you should never have comments in your code, if possible. Second, this can create bug in the future if someone decides to uncomment your code. But if you absolutely need to save it somewhere, open a notepad, save your code inside, and delete the notepad when you actually use it. Because let's be honest, you will probably never use it anyway. Now let's talk about the dry principle. A fancy name which means don't repeat yourself. This same code is used in two different functions. Create a short and simple function that do just that and does it well. Then add this new function inside your code, everything should be cleaner and more readable. And for the next tip, let's talk about if conditions. This is so complex to read, but with this pro tip, we will solve this right now. All you have to do is to convert the logic into a well-defined variable and put it inside your condition. If you want to be a better developer and get new coding tips like this every week, make sure to subscribe so YouTube will be more likely to show you the next video. Bye.